He's looking in his wing mirrors to see what's happening at the rear. It's Max Verstappen coming his way. Hamilton moves to the middle of the track, forces Verstappen wider at turn one and positions that Mercedes beautifully. But is that only temporary from Lewis Hamilton? Can he now hold Max Verstappen up as they head towards turn four? Hamilton's going to force Verstappen the long way round. By the time they get to the corner, he's about a third of a car in front. By the time they get out of the corner, he's a whole car in front. Max Verstappen is ahead of Lewis Hamilton. But will Hamilton be complaining because he took the position whilst off the racetrack? He's given it back because he took the position off the racetrack. It's lights out and away we go. Verstappen gets an excellent reaction. Hamilton, though, is ahead of Perez, but not for long, as Max Verstappen now on the inside joins Hamilton in battle. It is Hamilton and Verstappen. Verstappen and Hamilton wheel to wheel going into the field of the Temporello chicane. Hamilton is forced wide and he's lost a little bit of bodywork as well. Sergio Perez is in second, third place at the moment, looking to make it into second. The rest covered in a blanket of spray. Verstappen leads the Emilia Romagna. Grand Prix from Lewis Hamilton. The two championship protagonists came together at the first breaking point. And it's lights out and away we go. Once again, Max Verstappen gets a decent start. Not as good as yesterday. Hamilton is right with him. Leclerc is already ahead of Bottas. Verstappen's ahead of Lewis Hamilton going through the second turn. It's the Red Bull, but Hamilton's coming back. Into Village we go. It is Verstappen from Hamilton. Then Leclerc, Bottas and Ricardo ahead of his teammate uh, Lando Norris. Verstappen's going to have to weave like crazy. Hamilton got a better drive off the loop. He will be faster down the Wellington straight He's into not, Brooklands. Not going to get a chance to weave because already Hamilton is with them. They almost touch. They go into Brooklands. Verstappen stays ahead. The crowd roar their approval for this. The two championship contenders giving it everything. It's not over yet because Hamilton gets another slipstream all the way down the old pit straight into Cobb's corner. These are critical corners for this Grand Prix. Hamilton's going to try again. This time on the inside a continent touch. Verstappen is out of the race and that's a big crash into the cops. Lewis Hamilton and Max Verstappen coming together. Hamilton continues on. Charles Leclerc now leads the British Grand Prix. But for the second time this season, Hamilton and Verstappen clash and tangle on the opening lap. But this time it is ending in dramatic consequences for the championship leader. It was the merest of touches, but it was enough. And look how the wheel has come loose from the rim uh, as well. The tyres come loose from the rim. I said it wasn't over yet, didn't I, as they came out of Luffield. Was there a bit more room to the right that Hamilton should have been finding? They, hasn't, yes, red flag. They need to repair that tyre barrier. opportunity uh, based on what occurred at turn one two we would drop you back behind Hamilton that is my offer uh, yeah we'll accept that we understand the order will be Ocon Hamilton Verstappen that is correct he'll get the DRS here and Lewis and, and he's got the slipstream too Martin and he is gaining and he is gaining and he is gaining on Max Verstappen he's gonna go for the move here Lewis Hamilton trying to get into the lead of the race they go wheel to wheel into the first corner Verstappen has to bail out Lewis Hamilton has to bail out Verstappen ends that sequence with a bigger lead over Lewis Hamilton Max so let's give the position back to Hamilton Obviously, do that strategically oh, oh they've touched the and they've back. collided Max Verstappen and Lewis Hamilton how much damage 
edge on Hamilton's Mercedes. What has happened there? Verstappen being told to give the place back to Lewis Hamilton. Slowed down on the straight. Hamilton ran into the back of the Red Bull. Just what is going on here in Jeddah tonight? Max left a lot of space to the inside, but then he accelerated immediately away from it again, didn't he? No, Nicholas Latifi has crashed, and I think that is at turn 14. That will be a safety car. And, and Max coming into the pits, pit. Max Verstappen. Hamilton stays out. Verstappen coming into the pits, and I would imagine there's a set of soft tyres waiting for him to go on to that Red Bull car. Yes, it is. One, Hamilton has the advantage. Verstappen has the faster, fresher tyres, and we have got 3.2 miles of racing action all the way to the chequered flag as the crowd roar the drivers on to the final lap of this race and Verstappen sets after Hamilton. Is it going to be a first world championship for Verstappen? Is it going to be an eighth world championship for Lewis Hamilton? Where can Verstappen try and get past Hamilton? First overtaking zone is normally down in the turn five. Is Verstappen far enough back? He's going to make the lunge down the inside. Hamilton sees him coming. It's a late lunch by Verstappen, who takes the lead of the race. Verstappen now snatches the championship trophy from Lewis Hamilton, who's trying to fight back. No DRS for two laps, so Lewis Hamilton will not get the rear wing open. He's now he's going to go down the outside. If Verstappen keeps it tight and neat, but he hasn't. He's gone a little bit wide. This race that started with controversy is ending with controversy. No, Lewis Hamilton though, down the back straight, he's got a slipstream, he almost touches Verstappen, they almost make contact into turn nine, Verstappen stays ahead of Lewis Hamilton, of all the drama, of all the controversy, of all the magic moments in Formula One in 2021, it comes down to this, and at this moment, it looks like it's going to go the way of Max Verstappen, Mercedes not happy, Red Bull will be delighted, they have shared a brilliant championship battle, but the championship can only be won by one, and it's going Dutch in 2021. Oh my lord, Max! Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh my god! The bubbles and the sparkly stuff to celebrate as a Formula One World Championship for the first time. The chapter has ended. I hope you stayed right until the end. And if it was worthwhile, well, don't forget the sequels coming our way in 2022 in 98 days time. Just enough time for Verstappen and Red Bull to celebrate a championship under the lights in Abu Dhabi.